Hey guys, we are going to go through one lap on the simulator in Silverstone today. So the F1 uh, straight, then you have the right hand, the left hand, which in the simulator in the FIA 3 car is flat, but you have to really hold the steering wheel. Then you go to the first right hairpin, let's say, which is in third gear. Don't go to the outside completely to be able to prepare for the left hander, which is more important because there's this long straight coming after, which you do the corner in second gear and try to be on front as early as possible. And you have to straight. The next corner will be a left hander, which is in fourth gear. It's actually a pretty quick corner. The apex is pretty late, so you try to be on the apex late. Then you have this double right hander, let's say. It's a corner where you have to be at the apex pretty late as well, so you have to drive it from the back. It's in third gear, then you have this long straight coming up. The next corner will be a really quick right hander. In real life I think it's going to be flat, but in the sim you do it in fifth gear and lift a little bit. On the exit you always have to keep in mind that there will be track limits. Um, then you have magnets and backwards. It's flat in fifth gear that you lift and shift down to fourth and then for the last one you shift down to third again. I think you can also do it in fourth actually in the simulator but it depends on how quick you arrive. Um, then you have this long straight going up to the quick right hander which is in fifth gear I think on the sim. Um, really quick one also in real life you really have to focus to be on track for the exit because of track limits and then the last corner is the chicane in second gear, try to get both apex curves and have a good exit for the main straight at Silverstone and then that's one lap from the simulator.